6.13 in the morning. Yeah. We're on the road, on the road, been on the road for about, about two hours, almost. Yeah. On our way to Baltimore, to Morgan State. Going out there to, to do our do our part for the vote, get people out to the polls, vote in this presidential election. I feel good about that. Any any comments, Python? I wish the sun would come up. It was kind of depressing driving in this darkness at 6.15 in the morning. Is it I as depressing as the economic situation we're facing today? Nah, but you know what? We're going to get through it, though. Yeah. We're going to it. Yeah. Well, with no sun, though. You know what I mean? Well, the sun, yeah. I mean, yeah, that's that would depressing. be more depressing, okay. I think. Yeah, yeah. But, yo, yeah. it's another one of those weekends. Because after that, we're also heading down to D.C. That's right. And, uh, you know, we're going to meet up with... Uh, Homeboy Taz from Japan flying in. That's what's up. Got some stuff going down. Call so, me the I-95 MC. Stay, stay with us. Back and forth, you know what I'm saying? I, you know, it's like second nature right now. I can set the cruise control. I ain't got to look at the road because it's the I-95, you know. Maybe I should look at the road. It's trucks Yeah, you, you should. There's like, I do this all the time. It's, it's like nothing. mad trucks. <laughs> yeah, we on, we on the road with the truckers, you know what I'm saying? In the Lex, we hugging the road like Jay said. <laughs> we mad low. Yeah. Get a pothole, it's a wrap for us. We end up being like roadkill in the season. Yeah, with these trucks and shit, man. Yo, so good. stay up, watch. <laughs> That's what we try and do. We'll keep, we'll keep you updated. That's what we do. We produce diamonds in a rough. Mr. James is a diamond in a rough. <laughs> Okay, I told you my history. I dropped out in 1980 with a 1.77. But I had finished my bachelor's in 2002 and I'm working on my MBA and I'll be done January 2010. And then I'm going for a PhD. I'm not playing around. I'm going to practice what I preach. And those who know me, I put money in my pocket and then I give it to you. I got book scholarship and my Will and Postel scholarship for books out of my pocket. It don't come from Morgan, it comes out of my pocket. But that's how much I care. It may not be a lot of money, $50, $100 for those individuals who do the challenge, but it's something. I practice what I preach. I tell my son all the time, I took my son at five years old to show how to do the voting process. You gotta go down and reach down to somebody's neighborhood and help them. We do not need the government to raise our children. What we need is dedicated people. Telling people to pull your pants up. And let me tell you something, black men, men of color, my white brothers and sisters, men, you gotta stop wearing your pants past your buttocks. Amen. Your gluteus maximus, Amen. which is the scientific word for your butt. That's sickening. The only one who'll be attracted to it that I heard of is my uncle, who is a homosexual. So he likes it. So, and in jail, that's where it comes from because they call you tenderonies. I'm gonna take you, you little fish. But you got your butt down and thinking that's cool. That ain't cool. You're on the college campus. Pull your drawers up. Women, stop looking like harlots. And that's a hoe. Those who don't know. Look like a woman of distinction. You will never, once you, once you enter Morgan State University, be considered John Doe. The Morgan State University student John Doe. I don't care what happens to you. So you don't represent yourselves no more. You represent me and this institution. And when you represent Mr. James, and you can ask this brother right here, I have a high standard. I have a high standard because that standard was put on me to achieve beyond my measure, to instill and entrust and to invoke Participate in the community to give back. So we got to Baltimore. We made it. Yeah. You know what I'm we did it, yo. We're here. Here we are. Be more. The sun did come up. So we worried about that. We had concerns about the sun not coming up earlier. Hurry up. Hurry up. You know Hurry up. Yeah. So we are here. We did it thing. It was cool. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. up. Oregon State. Appreciate it definitely. As you can see, I'm tired. Another one of them long nights. Python's been up the longest, but you yeah. know, still. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, this is this is my man KB, What's up? who uh, helped make this possible. I'm the ambassador from Morgan State. Heard up. From New York. So how'd, how'd you think it? How'd you think it went? Yo, y'all knock it out, man. Y'all knock it out. Like, like, yo, tell about the rally. What was the point of the? The point of the rally was to. To, to, to show politicians and fat cats in Washington that they 
basically that the youth does care what happens in this country. We do care about the people that's unrepresented. And we call it a rock the boat because we want the people to rock the boat. Basically, yeah, we want the people to rock the boat of what usually goes on in Washington. Right. And I thought it was, it could, it could be any more appropriate to have y'all here and have hip hop. Because that's, that's basically the, the the greatest representation that the youth have right now. Exactly. Word. You heard that. You heard that. Pay attention to that one. Gotta pay attention. And once again, peace. Thank you to Morgan State for having us out here. No problem. Peace to KV. Whatever, come again. What's good? Yeah, man. Peace New York. Definitely. Word up. Until next time. No time for the jibber jabber. Post interview wrap up. How you think? How you think things went? Beautiful. It was wonderful. Definitely tell y'all are genuine about the work. You know, he actually took the time to come to Morgan, you know, do a rally and everything. And he came and sought me out. I've been riding on the third floor. Oh, know. and we went through a lot. Oh yeah, <laughs> to get to you. It was a drink because I was like, oh hey, more people. Like, yeah, we we went through a lot. <laughs> we went up to the second floor uh -huh. and walked down there to find you got to the end of the hall and they were like oh she's up on the third so we went through the stairwell there we got locked in yeah we got locked in the stairwell <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we went up <laughs> yo KB struggling with the door and I'm like yo dude like, it's like a key swipe and it's red right there <laughs> That's so we're like, alright, let's go back down to the door we came in. I'm like, I'm like, yo, what if? He's like, don't even say it. You're like, you're like that would suck. We got there, yo. It sucked. It sucked. So we had to go further down another flight, walk back, and then come back up the stairs, you know. So it was a trek to get to you. We put in work. So we're talking about Googleable. Google, 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 Google. So yo, this is the number one Googleable <laughs> hip hop show at Morgan State. Word. The number one. Googleable. This. We don't we don't play with number two. Thank you. Just bam, it's right there. So electric relaxation. See, you can't even say it straight. Electric relaxation. Three times fast. Three times fast. KB, go. Electric relaxation, electric relaxation, electric relaxation. All right. Yes, on. sir. Yeah, he got it. He got it. Big We're problem. here in Maryland. Still on the same weekend. Western Hotel. Out here with with the man from Japan. What's up, people? Taz. Yep. Got me and Dizzy out from Maryland. We got artists extraordinaire down there doing his thing. Come with me up there. Peace. Huh? He's busy. He's busy. He's busy. Forget it. <laughs> then you got pies all over there and passed out on the bed. I have passed out. I'm Googleable. Googleable. Word up. It's more pie. Googleable. Yeah. Googleable. Yo, just chilling until Don't tonight. The art, the opening tonight at Art Wino. I don't even know the significance of cheeseburger sushi, but you know, that just sounds cool. Yeah. So. I'm showing the bed. You can get out there. Oh, yeah, the bed is natural. You can't appreciate by looking at it. <laughs> no, you can't. You can't. Put the camera on it, and they can feel how soft it is. Yeah, you can't really do it like that. Anyway, we're going to do the thing tonight. You can see I'm tired. <laughs> I'm tired, yo. Chill. And you know what's messed up? It's like I'm full as all get out. I'm, but my mouth is dry. I'm thirsty. I want something to drink, but I'm too full to drink anything. So, like, that's not even cool. Like, you know, like, I don't know where we at, too. Did you tell them? You said we're in Maryland? Yeah. This is like a new spot, like National, National Harbor. Harbor. I didn't even hear it before. National Harbor, Maryland. It wasn't even on the GPS. I had to pull out the. I had to pull out the, the iPhone to get the get the Google Maps going. It was Googleable. And that's what's. That's what's up. All right, back in New York. It's what time is it? It's like about two o'clock. About two o'clock in the morning right now. Yes, sir. Just getting in. Big up to Morgan State, KB, WMUR. Big up to Art Wino. Taz, Hamburger Sushi, whatever that was called. It was good seeing Taz. Big up Zaya, big up Shane. All right, y'all. Yo. Peace, Peace out. out.